Yo, what's up, guys? This is 813YT, y'all. Make sure to drop a like and make sure to drop a sub, all right? If I help you out, and I'm about to show you how to download Fortnite on iOS and Android. Y'all didn't know Android is not banned on your iOS. So, first, we're going to show Android first. So, y'all, if you are new, and I do help you out, I just need you to drop a like and a sub, all right? So, people can get the video can get recognition to people need help and need to know how to download all right so if i do go please start the channel all right and watch me i'm trying to get my station all right so i'm gonna show how to uh, download fortnite on uh, android first then i was second now what you want to do is you're going to go to google or chrome you want to type in fortnite then you want to go down or do you see fortnite free something with cross play and then type press on that and then it's gonna say download for you then you want to press download then it's gonna take you to you can download the epic game app and then after you download epic games app you can download fortnite from the epic games app and then you you're good all right that's for androids now i'm about to show you two tips this is for pc and wild pc i don't know if it's meth i know the PC method works, so I think I'm pretty sure the uh, the one without the PC still works. All right, I'm gonna show you right now. All right, before I show you it, let y'all know these these two videos are not made for me. I'm gonna be linking them down in the description below. Uh, if you wanna go so to you can. It doesn't matter. All right, watch the whole video if you wanna learn how to you no know, download Fortnite on iOS now. These are two ways you can do it. The first way is how to download it while a PC and how to, to download it with a PC, the second way. All right, see y'all, peace. So I'm not even gonna say. So what you're gonna do is scroll down and it's gonna say for Safari, you're gonna click launch. Why is the reflection so big? What the heck? Okay, so after you click that, I don't like how it's showing me, but it's whatever. Okay, so after you click that, what you're going to do is click this share button. So at the top right corner, you click this share button. So after you click it, you're going to scroll down and click add bookmark. Well, not bookmark. What am I saying? You're going to click add to home screen. You go right here. It's going to tell you if you want to add it again, and you should add it. Now you can see it's on my iPad. So now I'm going to click on my iPad. All right, so you're going to click agree and continue. Now you're on the app like next week. Thursday wait yeah this week Thursday Fortnite mobile is gonna come back remember you're gonna have to pay like five dollars a month or something but either way I really think it's this is the other way how to download Fortnite with a PC all right it doesn't matter what PC or lots that you have all right y'all if y'all are new to channel please drop a like and a sub I'm asking you that if I do help you out y'all make sure to drop a like so this video can get recognition for people who need help with it all right peace amazing.com and whether you're on a PC or a Mac, you're going to be able to download this. So you just hit free download. And it'll start downloading the file. And then once you get it downloaded, you just click on it. Assuming you're using Chrome. And then on Windows, you just hit yes. And then you can download iMazing. On Mac, the process is a little bit different. So I don't have a Mac, so I can't show you guys how it looks like on there, but hopefully you can figure it out yourself. And the process is relatively simple. You just wait for it to install. Feel free to pause the video right now if your computer is slower than mine, so you can install iMazing really quick. And once you get it installed, which mine is pretty much done, you can go ahead and launch it. And now it'll say, please connect an Apple device. So in my case, I'm just going to plug in my iPhone 7. Uh, you don't have to back it up. I just hit later. And you want to hit manage apps. And while it's loading the apps, um, you want to make sure that your iPhone is compatible. So make sure that it's an iPhone 6S or newer, or else you will be able to load it onto your phone, but you're not going to be able 
to play. So once you get this page loaded, manage apps, make sure to search Fortnite. And now to get that, you, you can click a little button here. I already have it installed, but you want to hit uh, add from app store. So I already have it added, so I don't think I can add it again. Yeah, I can't add it again, but that's okay. You, you'll see a little download button and then you hit add from app store. And then up here, uh, you can see I'm already signed into my Apple account, my I Apple ID. For you, it'll pop up when you add it from the App Store, so you can sign into your own Apple ID, and hopefully you can uh, download it onto your computer. And then once you get it downloaded onto your computer, you hit Install to Device. And what this will do is that it'll copy the file from uh, your computer straight onto your iPhone. So it'll be right there and ready for you in a matter of minutes or even seconds if your computer is fast. So I can see it now, it's just generating the application. And you guys can tell by the date of the video. This is October 29th. So this is a real way to get Fortnite onto your iPhone. All right, so you guys can see once here it says installed with the check mark. Go back to your iPhone and you'll see Fortnite installed. And you just go ahead and open the app and then you'll be able to log in and play it.